Hey folks, it's Andy here. I wanted to do a really quick tribute to Gary Moore. It's been a few weeks now since he passed away and just wanted to uh, pay my respects for the uh, wonderful impact that he had on me as a young guitarist. I started guitar in grade eight and I was having dinner with my family at a place called The Pizza Pub and uh, they had this CD on and at that stage I wasn't into blues at all. My, Metallica was my big thing. I liked, you know, heavy, well not heavy stuff, but you know, rocky stuff and wasn't into blues and they had this CD on and it just grabbed me. I was like, wow, that's like wicked, wicked guitar. Like I was into Joe Satriani and stuff, but not blues as such. And I was just like, what is that? It just captured my attention. And I was a pretty shy kid. And so I really wanted to know what this was. I wanted to get this CD. You know those moments where you just hear something and straight away you just, what is that? I need to get it. I need to know. And so I think I mentioned something to my mum and she was like, oh, I'll go up and ask. And I was like, no, I don't want to do that. I'll look silly or something. And so I so needed to know that, you know, I, I conjured up the courage to go to, go to the, the front desk, which it's funny looking back, like, so what? <laughs> And I asked him and, and the guy goes, oh, it's looked around, it's, it's this. I was like, Gary Moore, oh, who's that? Blues Alive. Oh, so that's, that's sort of what blues is. I thought blues was kind of just, you know, old dudes sitting on the, on the front porch on their rocking chairs with their acoustic guitars. And um, so I went searching for it. And uh, my mum, I think, went halves with me. I can't remember. Or maybe she bought it and then I, I pilfered it later. Uh, I can't remember exactly. But got it. And Gary Moore was the starting point for me to get into the bluesy side of playing. I, you know, I knew there might be some kind of cool things in blues, but I just had a, a weird misconception about it. So especially for any younger players out there... Um, if you have a hunch that you might like a bit of blues, but most of it seems a bit old hat, and you're into like, you know, rocky stuff in your face, big bends and all that sort of thing, Gary Moore is the perfect bridging be point between rock and blues. Before he got into the blues thing, he was doing sort of 80s rock stuff, um, real kind of cliche 80s stuff, and just shredding it up, and then he got back to his roots and uh, got into blues again, and that's where it's still got the blues, got really big, and this album came out, uh, got 93 on here, and um, it's kick-ass, it's got all his best stuff on it, and just a really, really good starting point, you know, I'll give you a link underneath so you can you can find it for like a, um, a download purchase or whatever else, and um, check it out, Gary and Gary, <laughs> Gary, Gary Moore? Yeah, I'm just trying to emphasize how good it was. Thank you, Gary Moore, for uh, showing me the light of how cool blues is. Um, I don't know how much longer it would have taken me to, <laughs> to get into blues otherwise. So there we go. There's my little tribute to Gary Moore. Fantastic guitarist. We'll miss you.